Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Playframe and the two expert detectives show on a boat. Ahoy! Ahoy, everyone. So, we were starting our way back through on our chronological revisit of all these scenes. Oh, uh, shoot. And we were in chapter two, is where we were. I should have said, Ahoy, Watson. Ahoy. Oh, yes. Holmes, ahoy. Call me Sherlock. Did Sherlock ever solve a thing on a boat? Probably not. Probably not. Anyway. Um, what was the next one? Right, we need to go to, uh... Moving forward through the deaths? Right. Uh, or so through the scenes? Where is your corpse? Right, yours was getting In carried the up the room. stairs. Uh, what? No, that, I mean, it, it just said, in the surgeon's room. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I don't think, like, this is where the actual scene started, though. I think we, we oh. saw the scene... He might be the guy they're lifting up the stairs because he was going to be taken up to the carpenter's shop or something and prepared for... That might be... I but thought I he was in a body bag. Nope, he was not. All right, cool. His friend... Because this is Renfrid. Solomon was already in a body bag. You are... up, oh, right you are. Yeah. All right. You... I'm just going to call the doctor. We've been... <gasps> call like, the doctor! <laughs> we've been avoiding going for that this whole time for mm. no good reason. Okay, monkey man. So very clearly the surgeon, I think. We don't know how he died, though. We think he is on the boat with the two women who escape. Oh, you think so? Hang yeah, on. Yeah, he is on the boat. We think he escapes. Interesting. All right, hang on. Now I'm curious because I want to... Now I want to see. So if we zoom all the way... Uh... Maybe a little bit too far? Further than that. Uh, yep. yep, see? There you go. And I am actually prepared to guess that all of these people escaped. Because, uh... Let's go for it. In chapter 10, the only part after this, there are no more bodies. We didn't see them anywhere. So un unless their boat, uh, like, capsized or they all Off. fell out or something... Yeah. I think they just escaped. So, the... That is Emily. Okay, uh... Do, 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 do. Glad you remember the face. It's more the position, the pose in the artwork that I remember, but mm. yeah. She's also the older of the two. There we go. And, uh, then and I'm going to say... I thought escaped. escaped was one of the ones in here. I thought so too. Um, uh, torn apart definitely is not escaped. Expired, exploded, fell, froze, illness. Could you... Alive! alive. There it is. Oh, and escaped is... Whoa! Oh no. Oh no. Um All right, well we, that's that's okay. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We can Europe. We can uh figure that out by going up here. Where's closest? Oh yeah, the Canary Islands. Uh Canary Islands. Or... They're actually closest between Madeira and Azores, which I don't know if those were options. Uh, yeah. Let's check and see if they were. Hmm. Let's do. Yeah. Um. Cause. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Rats. I thought, and here I thought we were gonna have some easy ones. Right. I think it's unfair to demand that we tell them where those people are today, five years on. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Uh. Okay, there is the Azores. Or whatever, however that's said. The other one, M whatever, is not a la an option. It is not. It might just be a part of Africa or uh, or the mm. Canary Islands. I'm not sure. Mm. But uh, I'm fine saying that one for sure. now. If we do that for everybody, then we'll see if we're right. I don't know how we would guess that. Uh, other than the location on the map. Yeah. That's Miss um, Jane Bird, is it? Yes. Yeah. And we'll say alive in Azores. And then same Until we hear otherwise. Davy James. Uh, which is a total stab in the dark. Based solely on his height and position. True. In relationship to the fourth mate. It's a lot of guesses that I'm and not hearing confirmation on, so something's nothing. wrong. So you want to try a different island? Let's try. Why not? Alive on... Can, no, Canary Islands is not close. Uh, yeah, it, it's kind of close, but it's not the closest. Uh, okay. It might be there's something they say in that scene. 
Yeah, uh, that may be as well. So let's check the... Uh, you know, we'll get to chapter nine soon enough. <laughs> sure. We've got their identities probably guessed, though. And we know that one of them, like... Yep. Yeah, we got enough. Let's go back to, yes, Renfrid's death. So we're pretty sure you are the surgeon. Yes. Uh, we just know that he his fate is currently incorrect, but we'll get to it later. You are Martin. Martin. At yes. least we're pretty certain. I mean, he's already confirmed, isn't he? He's not confirmed yet, but that's oh. just because we don't know how he died. That's the surgeon's mate. Betcha. I bet you're right. Is he near the surgeon in this scene? Where's the surgeon in this oh, scene? Because a lot I'm of times wrong. they're standing near e each other. That's not probably always the case, but a lot of the time. Uh, you know, I don't remember. Yeah, here, easy way to find out. Uh, where are you in the scene? You are... Oh, back, back by the helm. There, okay. There's something about him that rubs me the wrong way. So the surgeon's back in the helm. Surgeon... A little bit further to the left of the helmsman. Ah, there you are. So that could be the surgeon's oh, mate back there. Yeah, and that guy has a fancy tie as well. This is the guy who had the books in the, uh, that was in the lifeboat trying to get out. Yes. I'm going to guess this is the surgeon's mate, actually. I'm going to guess you're right. Because Books. I mean, it could also be the purser. Up, up. Like, oh. I don't know why the purser would feel like they've really got to save their books, though. <laughs> mm. Uh... You, though, are a mystery. I don't know. Dancing has an apron. Hanging out with all the other passengers and the captain steward. Can't be Nunzio, because he's yeah, are already there gone. Any other passengers who we haven't? Nope. nope, we got all the passengers, so. Mm -hmm. Rats. Nope, he is not a bunch of rats in a human suit. That we know of. Hey, let me see your arm. Nope, okay. Uh, right. Okay, so he's not a friend of Renfrid's, and he's not... Huh. These are the other friends of Renfrid's. These two. Yeah, and we've got you all. Okay. Yeah. Because they're with Solomon there, and... Yep. Just making sure there's no one hiding out here we didn't know about. That's fair. Or here. Sneaks? Nope. No sneaks. Uh, there are some others around, though. Uh, there's you two who we know mm -hmm. already. And... That might be everybody. Hmm. Yep. I think that's everyone for this scene. Very well. All right, so... So you are still a mystery, but we know that you were... Dancing? Clawed. Uh... Oh. I think you were one of the ones who was beheaded later boat. by the crab. Oh, 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 or yes. Or we were claw... Yeah, I think you were beheaded by the... Uh... Do you want to check which six memories he was in? Can Will we do you that tell us? Here? First memories on page 16, perished in Soldiers of the Sea. So, yeah, I think this is the... Uh... Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Claude uh, beheaded by crab. Yeah. Right on. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I don't think... You know... Hmm. You're here in the scene, though, and just acting all chill... You weren't, like, near, uh, you weren't near, uh, Renfred early, in earlier scenes. I can't think of any other reason you'd be here. You might be the surgeon's mate. Want to go with that? And then we can try, um, purser for book dude? Yeah, we could try that. Or, hmm. apron, kind of hardy looking dude. They're hmm. taking Renfrid to the carpenters to prepare him for burial at sea. You might be onto something there, actually. I bet he's the carpenter. I bet, I bet you're right. We're going to get a scene where we can see those the uh, carpenters later, too. So we can, uh, we'll can we see but you just, if you were one of the two. You just marked him as the surgeon's mate. Uh, all right, we can mark him as unknown again. Uh, but let's see. I think he's the carpenter. I think you might be right. I just, like, I know we get a scene of them, like, actually in there. We can see if we can recognize them there. Okay. Uh, I think that's everyone now. So, yeah. what was next after... I think it was the cow was the next one. Mm-hmm. So, uh, exit, here we go. Man. 
Allergies are no fun. Yeah, no, the uh, seasonal allergies are definitely no fun. Sorry. Uh, Not to bring too much, you know, real life into this. <laughs> or whatever. Uh, boat allergies are the worst. Boat um, allergies. I'm allergic to death So we don't crab. know more about you other than that you died in an explosion near the end. Uh -huh. Um, you, I believe, were identified as the butcher. You, you. He's got fancy sleeves on his jacket. You, we also don't know. Knifed by unknown attacker at some point. Given, like, what they're doing here, I'm guessing they're probably midshipmen. A topman would have no reason to be down here working on, like, helping with cow butchering. You have the same sleeves as sleeves. each other. What sleeves. position did you have? You are a midshipman as well. So, yeah, let's say you are also a midshipman. I think that that makes total sense. Uh, unknown midshipman. Your sleeveys. Cool. How many midshipmen's are left, actually? I do not know. Uh... Who we've not identified. Probably... There's only two. Oh, I was going to say probably a lot. Uh, Peter Milroy and Thomas Lenke. There's none above that? Nope. We've either identified Wait, them all... go up one more. Unknown midshipmen, yeah. Okay, so there are only two midshipmen... That we've uh, that not we identified, identified yet, anyway. Identified. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. And it's not like guessing will tell us anything, because we don't know who killed him either. Right. Can we... Look at the dialogue from this scene. Yeah. Real quick. Let's do. Uh, take him to the carpenters, get him wrapped and see to the last rites. Yeah. Get her here once we get the skull here. Yeah, come on before she kicks up. Uh, hmm. Now both midshipmen are English, so like accents won't help us either. You all right there, sir, is talking to Charlie. That doesn't seem right. Hmm. Hmm. Do you have the midshipman sleeves as well? Yes. It's hard to tell, but I think so. I believe he does. All right. I believe they're all dressed the same. Who else is around? Chicken. <laughs> Chickens are always watching. Ah, yes. So the monkey was hanging out with you. I now, see. who's carrying... Solomon up. Is it his friends? I think yes. 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 Or not Solomon. I'm sorry. That's Renfrid. But yeah, um, I believe that's his friends carrying him up. Where are the proposed Carpenter and Martin? And do they already have... Either in here or they're already in I their think, space. I think they've already taken Solomon's body bag up and mm. Renfrid is going up after. Okay. Or this is not immediately after the scene in the... Um, it might not be immediately after the scene in the surgeon's room. Might just be a little while after. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how quick after that mm. this happened. Okay. I think we're wrapped up with chapter two now. Okay. Still some gaps, but that's okay. We can always circle back again if we need to. That we can. I need to know where the monkey went. I need to get to chapter nine and see if the monkey's on the lifeboat. <laughs> we need to find that out. I need the monkey to be okay. So now we're back to the chapter... Uh, this the is... chapter three, the murder. We've got that one figured out, and I think the only others present we have fully identified. Uh, we, we don't, don't know, know who Hatman is yet, so Man we is. can't. Yeah. Yeah, so we can't say who killed that one. But otherwise, We're that good. scene we are good on. Uh, Trying to be sure of where the monkey is is like watching Alien. <laughs> and worrying about the cat. Uh, I worried so much for the cat through all of Alien. Do we want to go back to the scene where we see everyone on deck again? I don't know if there's more we can really glean from there, but maybe it um, wouldn't hurt. We can. Murder, no, he's done nothing wrong. It's too late. Quiet. Mm. Hmm. Bad call, Cap. Bad call. Indeed so. You killed an innocent man. Let's... Here, we'll go back to the scene ju and just, like, scan the crowd again, just in case anything springs to mind. Yeah. And in the likely case it doesn't, we'll move on to the next one. Sounds like plans. All right. 
Some of these are coming together fast, but I'm willing to bet. Oh. Some of them are really going to stump us. I'm sure. You have been found guilty by self-confession. All right. Um. Man, he looks like he's about to jump. Like, like he... There's something about his posing that looks like he is... It's like the bent arms and stuff. Yeah, like he's ready to move. The lean forward as well, and mm. that might not actually be a lean forward. It might just be his posture because of the deck. Or whatever. Hmm, all right. That person is clearly associated with the man in front of him, right? I could see that being the case, actually. So who, here we have... We have Nichols. Mm. And so it's either, like, and Nichols person... is steward, or it's someone who is in, like, cahoots with Nichols on... I think it's maybe Nichols' steward, because... Let's try it. He was also the person who went with Nichols on the boat and got killed by it been Sai. Nope, it been Sia. There we go. Second mate steward. Let's say it. Uh. Hmm. I don't Nickel, know. Nickel's we... a second mate, yeah. Let's check that again, because I don't remember for sure. I don't think that was second. I think Nichols was fourth. Nichols Nichols a second mate. I'm wrong. Uh, I'm wrong. Hmm. And Look at their outfits, though. Yeah, their outfits are... If we can figure out... Uh, One, two... Can we find someone else who's wearing something like that, and can we identify them as a steward? Because if so... Check the boy... Not boy, but... Okay, he doesn't have that. You are you are a steward, though. Did we get that right? Are we yes. sure? Yes. Yeah, this one's... Okay. Well, no, I guess it's not confirmed. It's still a guess. We just don't... We don't know where... I'm willing to bet the uh, character is guess is correct, but where the... they wound up, we don't know. The location, yeah. Assuming that is the steward garb, though, then we have a couple others who could be identified as unknown stewards as well. Yeah. Uh. That mm. may be a guess too far, but... Hmm. And you were on the boat. So whether, collab whether steward or not, you are a collaborator. For sure was a collaborator. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. But maybe... Okay, that's not an outfit for a topman. Because the topmen have much less, like... The topman stuff doesn't look super... Standardized. Standardized. Yeah. And where it is, it doesn't include wraps around the waist that might encumber their movement. Mm hmm They're not seamen and they're not midshipmen given their outfits either. I don't think. Oh, heck, I can't. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, we're starting to make, like, <laughs> supposition on top of supposition, which is always yeah. a dangerous place to get. But I'm feeling like this feels somewhat like a uniform and like a steward uniform to me. Mm -hmm. I may be wrong, but it's... It's a uniform of some sort, and I just don't know what it means yet. The jacket yet. is the same as the steward yeah. that we did identify. I believe so. So, uh... Or that we think we've identified. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Grr! Do we words, have anything on you? Words are so hard. Other than just being spiked, and that's it. Hmm. All right. Let's move on to the next scene, because I don't, uh... Actually, let's check arms. Any, uh, tattooed arms is... Please present your arms. We're looking for number 47. I think, or 37. I'll double check it when we find your arms. Hmm. A silhouette of a lady? Anyone? 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 Help us out here. Please show us all your arms, please, maybe? This may not be the fastest way to go about that search, but... Yeah, especially given how very conservatively many of these sailors dress. Mm. Show a little skin, boys. Nothing. Bunch of prudes. <laughs> <sighs> so many layers. All right. Next scene. Which is... 
you, the one shot, right. Okay. And that is a confusing scene still. Um, let's go back to it. Sure. I know we were just there twice, but... It is confusing. It's a real confusing one. There's a lot going on in that moment, and we don't have a whole lot to tell us. Let's listen to the whole thing again. Yeah. Okay, so he's the man who said, give it up. And he looks to be a topman from his outfit and his posing on the ship. Yeah. Uh. Sounded English accent, but that's all a little hard to tell always. But, uh. Yeah. So, okay. That's the guy we just guessed incorrectly as the second mate's steward. Right. Or at least we think incorrectly. You, uh, we know. You, oh. we know. You, Are we don't know. That's the translator, isn't it? Uh, no, the translator is down here. Oh, right, 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 right. Sorry. But, uh, translator might still be in the scene, though. Yeah, Translator's got to be in this scene because uh, Translator gets in the boats later. I mean, Translator might not be... I think. Uh... Translator might not be in the scene right now. Translator might be getting things to take. True. I don't know. Like, he might still be under, like, below decks or something. True, true. Or he is in the scene and I just haven't recognized him. Mm, nope. I haven't been checking footwear either, but... <laughs> the th hardest thing about the footwear is that a lot of it's tough to read. Yeah. What we'd seen in that bunk where we were talking about the, like, the sort of wrappings on the lower leg, mm -hmm. I believe that's the footwear of a topman. Is that the helmet? Disappears the in doom, so it doesn't die here. Um, I wonder if they're, they're the helmsman, though. I'm going to say, like, it's, we got no other, uh, leads on the helmsman. Mm hmm And this isn't going to, like, get us a complete yeah. fill-in either, because we don't know how they died, other than just probably just disappearing in some way. But, mm -hmm. uh, that seems like a reasonable guess to make. Man. Um... Hmm. Those jerks. Wait. Kidnapping people. You. Oh. Ah. Okay. One second. You are the one. Wow. What number? I'll tell you in a sec. Thir 37. 37. Timothy Butement. Perfect. Nice. We've made a lot of bad guesses, I guess. The but we know this one for sure. Clothing of the Topman. Yay. Rad. All right. Okay. Well, that's something. And also tells us many things are not correct. Yeah. Uh, Lars. Hmm. And. That's one of the. One of the midshipmen, as we think. Well, you're wearing the same uh, midshipman's outfit, so I'm going to keep sticking with that, even though it's probably not a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do we not have the third mate identified yet? Uh, we don't. We don't know how he died. We, oh. it's, it's Martin. We don't know how Martin died oh, yet. We right, know he right, died right. in the doom, or that he disappeared at least in the doom, or maybe mm. he died, but we don't know the okay. fate. Maybe yeah. we can guess at it a little better once we get back there. Sure. All right. I just noticed it wasn't crossed out, and I didn't see which name went with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you can see there on um on our victims legs that he's wearing something where like 
he doesn't have the wrap things, but mm-hmm. his shoes are really um, low and look kind of soft. Yeah. Which I imagine would be useful for climbing around in the rigging. I imagine so. Yeah. So what? Uh, what? He's a topman. He is a topman. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. 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 How are we? How are we on like the number of topmen we've identified? I don't, there's a lot of uh, Chinese descent looking ones. Mm-hmm. And Asian descent. Yeah. Yeah. But like, there's also just but, like a lot of Chinese topmen on the crew. Uh, like four? Yeah, yeah, like four of them. And one who we guessed at, no, one here who we're pretty sure about. Mm-hmm. Uh, one who we have no idea, though. I'm like, I have a guess on that one, but. Uh, I might as well. Um, no idea. I guess a lot of these we have no idea, huh? Yeah. Hmm. I'm starting to wonder if this is our tattoos guy. It might be. I like that they have, what is it called when you only have the one name? I don't know. Like Cher? Oh, <laughs> the formal term. <laughs> yeah. No, there is a formal term for it. It's, it's like mononym. I just thought you said, like, you know, the term, Cher. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you have a Cher name. Lovely. Ah, yes. <laughs> Maba, like Cher. The Cher name, of ah, course. Ah, yes. Made famous by Cher. Uh, I think it's mononym, but you know. That's sure. Whatever. <laughs> it's cool. Uh, all right. I think that we've got everything we can out of this scene for the moment. I think so. And I think that's the end of chapter three, which brings us to chapter four, which is, I think, where things... Oh, that's when we're out at sea in the boats. Ah. So we, we might be able to piece together a lot more out there now. Now that we know a little bit better what's going on with mm-hmm. them. So wait, who was the first one? Yeah, hang on. The calling. How do we start the calling? Uh, and first... Was accessible our translator. only through other corpse. Got it. Uh, accessible only through other corpse. Accessible oh. only through other corpse. Oh. Corpse move post mortem. Yes. So Miss Lim's body lays on the top deck. Got it. Okay. She's where we can start from. Yeah. She and two others, I think, are laying right there. Yep. 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 Uh, all right. Okay, and not all that talking, I think, was, uh, yeah, you. Mm hmm. All right. Uh, so here we have Unknown Topman speared by beast. Mm hmm. And yep. guessing second mate steward. And wait, they are knifed. Uh, did we Ooh. get that? Yeah, we got Knife. that. We got that right. Yeah. Okay. That one we, we knew. Because we saw him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We actually have pretty good evidence. We might be wrong with their... Identity? Identity, though. That's, uh, I'm I'm pretty sure we're wrong with their identity. In one of the scenes, we had a... Uh, we heard a Irish name. O'Hannon? Or like O'Hagan? O'Hagan or something. O'Hagan? Yeah. Uh, and that might be o- that might be O'Hagan. Uh, mm. Maybe. Yeah. Um... Who else do we have here? We got Nichols. Coward. And we've got... Sorry. Unknown. This might be Hagen for all we know. Uh, but speared by beasts, right? Um, and Miss Lim. I'm going to... I'm going to guess you are... Hagen. Or mm-hmm. O'Hagen or whatever the name is. It definitely starts with O. Yeah, O'Hagan. there you are. Patrick O'Hagan. Bam. Hey, <gasps> all right. That means some of our guesses were right. What? Which ones? Oh, boy. So you, good. Cool. Good, 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 guess. good. Good guess. And you also, good. Perfect. That we're one we pretty were pretty sure. sure about. And hey, okay, we are right about you. Heck which means yes. we're right about steward costumes. Good. Okay. We're getting somewhere. Does that mean all of the things that we have wrong were... 
just our incorrect guesses at the fates of the boat passengers? I think, yeah. I think our guess as to where they wound up or what happened to them is wrong. We can right. we'll get back to those scenes and guess then, but the fact that we're having to... Maybe they didn't escape. The fact that we're having to guess at several different land masses... Well, and <laughs> like you off. said, we might get some information about where they're heading. Also true. When we get to that scene. So who... Okay. Are we missing information on in this scene? It might be that it's only through other corpses that we're able to... Uh... Right. So you're the first in this... Uh, the, the first to die here, I believe. And you are the one who does the... Tr no, you're not no, the translator. but that's you're... not the translator, but they are the unknown topmen. Yes. Let's start with you. And listen for names. Keep course due east. You'll reach the Canaries in three days. You've packed enough stores? Aye, sir. Checked and loaded them myself. Good. Stay quiet and alert. If the wind picks up, we've no chance against the Obra Dinn. Shoot ya! The one swabble! One more one day! I shut it off. This is strange things. Above monsters. So that's they say strange thing. Okay, so it is the one. Uh, the only line the deceased here says is that last one. Okay, so that's the translator. No. Uh, they say strange things about monsters. Right. Uh, like, he's not the one who's... Tr he may not be the one who's translating in all of the scenes, but he's definitely uh, in this one. He is capable of translating. Right, 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 right. He may not be their official translator on the boat. Right, right, right. In fact, he's almost certainly not, but he is almost certainly one of the he's top one, men yeah. of Chinese descent. Yeah, one of the Chinese top men. But there's four of them, so... That's... We do need to figure out a little bit more or just guess randomly and use the game's mechanics. Yeah, and I'd love to not, especially if we're bouncing between four, I'd love to not have to do that. But Yeah, I'd love to narrow that down a bit. Is there anything... I can stop hitting the wrong buttons. Uh... All right. Is there... Hang Lee. Mm. Ooh, I'm going to not be able to say any of these names properly. My guess is Huang Lee. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. J I E. I don't know. Like Zhang is the, or Zhang, I think is the last name. Li Hong Wei Li. Yeah. Is this Jia? Jia? G? Jia? Apologies. Anyone who yeah. knows how to pronounce names right, I don't always. But yeah, I don't think any of this information, other than the numbers, which might give us something later. That might. I don't know how to, uh, we're going to need to start finding some other way to start narrowing this list down because we're not going to be able to guess with just this right here. Yeah. Um, and the clothing aspect hasn't been super reliable. Yeah. I don't feel like people can wear clothing from wherever. Yeah. It's hard to really rely on that. Especially in this profession, people who are traveling all over the world. <laughs> right. Like, even if most people from France would wear a striped shirt. Who's to say what a French person who spent years on a boat traveling the world would wear, wear yeah. when they don't have to adhere to a military uniform? I mean, in Charles's case, it happened to be true, but still. This is literally the only character in this boat who we don't know what happened to, or we don't know who is. Right. All the rest of them in this party we know we of. We have named, uh, yeah. First scene... And he's in how many scenes? Uh, he's one of the, uh, one of the sleeping characters in the, uh, in, uh, Solomon's, uh, okay. death to illness. So one of the many. <laughs> Let's look at his shoes. Let's look at shoes. Because there is one guy who has shoes dark colored without any wrap. striper pattern or anything mm, uh, almost looks like he's wearing hose huh a little bit yeah heck yeah uh look at his outfit his jacket is there anything you can give us bud hmm 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 
let's try uh uh Depicted in just SCC sketch bookmark memories. I've not used that yet, but I'm sure it's got to be handy at some point. Yeah. Show memories on deck map. Uh, all right. Present at the murder scene, as mm -hmm. depicted on the in the art. You are present in this scene as well, getting on one of the boats. Mm-hmm. Uh, present here asleep. So we either there either there's some way we can identify you in this scene. Yep. Or uh, there is a way, or we just have to process of elimination, figure out everybody else. Yeah, we may be able to identify from the bitter cold scene, though. I'm tempted to try. You want to take just a shot at see. it? Like just to see. We do have a nice chance to examine his detail here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so having done. Like having examined here, mm -hmm. seen the full costume and everything, uh, let's check what numbers we're looking for again. Uh, come on. And I can write it down this time. The numbers of the Chinese uh, crew are 38 through 41. Alrighty. And let's go back to that scene and find those. Uh, let's find those bunks, isn't the word, but hammocks. Yeah. Berths? B-E-R-T-H? Is that what that means? I don't know what that word means. Like, I've... I know the context of give a wide berth, but I don't know... I probably... That's probably not the right word, then. Well, there might be other uses. Oh! A, a ship's allotted place at a wharf or dock, or a fixed bed or bunk on a ship, oh. train, or other means of transportation. So it's not a berth, because it's not really fixed. That's true. Hammock swing. <laughs> <laughs> but. Uh, was sort it of close. yours? No, it was. It was Solomon's. Right. So go. And, all right, hammocks. This boy here, uh, 58, is the one that I felt the most sure of right. being and able this, to identify. And it's not, so... Yeah. This is not. Uh, okay. So they're over here. Okay. 37, 38, 39. And they're... Okay. So this one, it's definitely not 39. Because okay. different shoes. Uh, those shoes look right. But that was in 50-something. Right? That bunk? You're right, that's 59, 59. so it's not 40, not you. though. You can see 40. It's not, and 38, not those shoes. It's not those shoes? No, like, the, uh, the white socks and, uh... Oh, no, you're coming right. out of those, Yeah, different shoe style. So not it's not 38. 38. Uh, 40, 40, that looks right. 41... Is very hard to tell. Can't see the shoes well enough to say... But two it, in shade. Yeah. Looks almost barefoot, honestly. Mm. Let's say 40. Let's go with 40. Let's go with 40. I feel and like if it might we're be 40. wrong with 40, we can try 41. Yeah, no, it's one of these two. We've at least so. narrowed it to two. Uh, yeah, so. I'm, I'm good with that. Uh, 40, or no, sorry. Uh, yeah, 40. Yep. Uh, 40 all right, where 41. are you? Li Hong. Let's and go with it. We won't have a. A result quite yet. Right, right, right. Need to name some more folks first. Still though, that's something. All right. Mm -hmm. So we're we're done with that chapter. Like unless there's more interesting text that pops in, and I don't think any of it's gonna be super vital. Uh I'm game with Nope. Um Nope. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Ahoy, they're back. This scene might be worth seeing because there's going to be some other people here. Yeah. Let's uh, let's get a look at uh, this one. Ah, darn it. Uh, at Nichols's death, and body is on the deck. Okay. Yes. That one might be educational. I think you're right. It could be. We're getting good at this. Mm, slowly, Watson. <laughs> 
I need like. I will accept the role of Watson. I need a bubble Sherlock pipe. We do need to give you that. So I, I can guess we like... can just put bubble audio in the mix and no one will know. <laughs> oh, but I will know. I won't have the pipe. That's true. You'll just have more work. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not put the bubbles in. All right, Nichols. Give us information. Time to talk, Nichols. Ahoy! Well back. Here's the captain. Ahoy! The Wait! Don't shoot! I have treasure! I yield! Hold your fire! <laughs> All right. I'm still wondering, like, when did this... Was this just the Formosan group's cargo mm -hmm. that they just brought on board as passengers? Yes. It got discovered what they had. And he tried to steal it. Yeah, Nichols found out what they had, tried to, uh, or, at least, or at least once he found out what they had, started scheming to, to like, make this escape to steal it because it was it yeah. apparently super awesome. He kidnapped them, he took them out in two lifeboats, and then they got attacked, so he came back to the ship because he didn't have enough. And it was sort of cursed, so that, like, yeah. they got attacked, and then, yeah. Uh, yeah. okay. So, and coming back... We've got, um... We've got... Chiotan, I think it is? I believe so. Yeah. Uh, yes. And then... Anyone else visible? Someone's gotta someone be. someone else in the window. Someone else is up there. Not the same window, but the next window to the right. Ah, oh, right you are. Who are you? You're... John Davies. Davies, probably. Uh, we just don't know who killed you yet. Um... That might be it. I thought there were more people for some reason. I guess there's some other faces up here. And I guess we can, um... We can... Uh... Maybe it's not going to identify them, but... Mm -hmm. You were there, and... Uh... That one we've got confirmed. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's not, like, locked in. It's not... It's it? still It's still penciled in. Or he's still penciled in. Could you... But, uh... Check his... Because oh, it's penciled right. in because we can't, it's not allowing us to guess at his fate, fate yet. Fate yet. Yep. But we're quite certain of that one. Yep. All right. Not useful, but. Interesting. It was worth checking. Yeah. You never know what's going to end up being useful. All right. We are done with this chapter. Perfect. And why not? Let's go just a little further. Um. We've Jewish identified both of those disappearances. We've... Yes. Have we completely done this one? Except uh, for... That was a guess, but other than that, we've completed this chapter. Yeah. Uh, unknown... unknown we don't know... Hat dude. We don't know Hat Dude yet, but otherwise we have completed that chapter. Is Hat Dude a topman from his clothes, or...? Good question. I don't know. We, we'll have to get a closer look at Hat Dude next scene he's in. Yeah. Uh, we've got a, the it's brothers. one of the two brothers, but yeah, I haven't quite narrowed that down. We're not leaving a ton of gaps here, which is encouraging. Right? Like, okay, not too many to come back to if we have to do another pass. Yeah, exactly. Uh, all right. Chapter five, the unholy captives. Okay. Oh boy. Uh, location of corpses is up top, spiked by terrible beast, and also spiked by terrible beast. And I think we've got... Very little on this on this uh, topman here, or this supposed topman, I think. Mm. Uh, oh, seaman, sorry. Um, all right, where are you? Uh, this one. Lift your and fight the what the hell is going on? What do you know about Eve. these things? About the chest and your dead friends? Shell? What shell? All right. So there, those shoes. I don't remember what bunk it was. Um. Do you? Sorry, I'm thinking. Ah, uh, heck. 38? I kind of want to say a 38 as well. I think, it, I believe it was 38. I think it was 38. Uh, hang on. Uh. Yes, it was 38. Cool. Awesome. All right. You are Huang Li. I think. 
Aw, oh, heck. And you're the one who gets electrocuted later. We'll, uh-huh. we'll double check on that one, but I'm pretty sure 38 yeah. had these shoes. Or the one that was like, no, 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 this was this was 38, I think. We'll we'll double check that in a second. Sure. Uh you we still know very little about. There is Oh, right. The spikes. I was gonna say there's something coming out of his back, but it's 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 the spikes. Yeah. <laughs> there's a whole lot of Okay. Does he look English? Could potentially be, but uh it could be from Sierra Leona. I don't know. What do you think, game? Ah! Hey, all right. <laughs> who else have we got here? It's the three we just did. Oh, we, cool. We're right. And yes, all right. Look at us go. <laughs> Woo, man. We did it. We're good at Oberdins. We're still less than halfway through this crew. <laughs> goodness but at this rate though we started this week with like <laughs> only less than half of this yeah less than a quarter of the crew at the start of this week so yeah all right burning through this now you we what is oh that's the goat you, we know down. uh you that's we know charles. you're charles uh all right we got a bunch of other folks around here though Ooh. all right lots of folks yes and some of them we should be able to identify. You are... The guy I think is the carpenter preparing the dead. Huh. Because they're dead. That's they're true. Not, he's not a surgeon, so he's not doing surgeon things with them. Let's, I think he's the carpenter. Let's say you are the carpenter. I like your thinking. All right. And surgeon here, Where's probably. your monkey, Where's Henry? the monkey? Where's the monkey, Henry? Probably hanging with a goat. Um, monkey better be okay. Actually, actually, I'm glad the monkey is not up here with the meeple shooting spikes everywhere. Yeah. You are the captain, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, of the nightingale, 21 days from Clyde and Cole. What? Could he smell the flowers of Bermuda when he died off the died on the shoals off the North Rock Shore? I don't remember if that detail was in one of these memories. <laughs> He did not. He was no captain of the Nightingale. If he was, he would have given his life to save his crew and not done whatever he did not in the done bargain. The exact opposite. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Who else we got around here? Explain yourselves. You we know literally nothing about. Dice boy. Hmm. Maybe you are... Everyone else around here is a seaman in this yeah. uh, squad. Well... Except for the people who aren't. Except for the, yeah, people who aren't. All right, no ideas for you. Let's go back and look at his positioning. Okay, so he's doing grunt work. Lifting cargo. This is probably a seaman. Who's your associate here? Because if you're also a seaman, then yep. yeah, I'm going to say you are a seaman, given the work you're doing. Uh, I am guessing the same is true of the men working that big wheel thingy Martin, that I don't know what I bet is. you're right. Uh, John Naples. Seaman. Uh, first mate. These these boys. Seaman. Seaman. <laughs> yep. And... One more. Yep. All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Anything particularly identifying about any of these gents? Hmm. Beyond their... All right, we, we know who you are. Clothing. You are one of the brothers... Uh, your Lars. Seeing William we know reminded you. me of something. Uh, William is on the far side. You're staring at him. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, go in the portraiture, go straight up and one person over. Yeah. I think we have someone from Persia. A top man from Persia? Yeah. I think that's him. I'm fine with that. We don't know what happens to you at the end of, I believe, the uh, Squactopus uh-huh, chapter. Yes. So we'll have to do some guesses there. But I'm fine with that uh, assumption. I'm going with Persian based on my m- current, very vague knowledge of where Persia is, and the fact that the and just the garb. the headwear reminds me of um, what people who are proponents of Sikhism wear. Yeah, like of all and, the topmen that we have available to guess between. 
uh, that is my best guess as well. Yeah. And honestly, I'm kind You want to go of, with Maba for Tattoos Mixed Torn Apart? I think I do. I want to... Yeah, I'm willing to... Uh, I'm willing to go with that. Yeah. Um, but we don't have enough to lock in either of you two yet. Yeah. Uh, I think one of them is Odo. Not actually a name. <laughs> Just the person I thought looked like Odo. But I could be wrong. I th think <laughs> that's everyone in this scene. Except for the were tiger. Except for the were tiger. The, sorry, Ooh. not a were tiger. Tiger goat. Right. Goat is a tiger. Shh, don't tell anyone. It's a secret. <laughs> See, oh, gracious. Tiger goats. They actually did all the killing. No one can prove otherwise. All right. I think that's everything we can get here. I think so. Let's do one more. Uh... So, we got you, yep. and there may be some other, there's 28 others duck. present, we oh, should go to that my scene. my goodness, yes. <laughs> uh, location of corpse, you are just below deck here, I This think. is going to be the riders, won't it? Aren't we getting into the riders? Uh, I don't think the riders are here yet. I think this is when they're carrying uh, the... Oh, yes, yes. Purples down the... Uh, when the meeple are being carried down. Yeah, here you are. And he dies on the stairs. Or he gets slapped by the tail, rather. Yes. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And then a couple folks die on the stairs because of that. Watch your foot in. Hey there, what's this? Give him to me and I can prize a solid meal, boys. Have him now. Take it slow. One sec, gentlemen. There's a free shell here. Let's have a look. No, get back. All right. Lots of folks present. Okay. Including two stewards. Stewards? You, uh, we don't know who's yet. Uh, you, uh, our That's guest is fourth mates, so yeah. Um. We've got one of the stewards locked in. And one of them guessed at. Yeah. Can we process of elimination here? Oh, hey. Uh, there's a ship steward. Which, there is. Uh, okay. And then the third mate steward. And then third mates. Third mates from England, and ship steward is from India. We we see a shot later with a steward near Martin, who is third mate. That's almost definitely Roderick. Uh, okay. And that's so that's later on, and that might be. I think you. that's this guy. I think so, but we'll. Uh, I think that's the one that I misremembered seeing walking holding the plates yeah 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 Yeah. but uh yeah we'll so we'll probably be locking you in a little bit later um lots of other folks here okay who, who we got? do we think was speaking uh, we know that one of them was the chef but there were some other folks there was another voice close to him saying like look out I'm guessing either like you or one of the people actually carrying yeah, things that yeah, it's gonna be hard to narrow it down. Everything's so tightly packed in here. Yeah. Hmm. We know okay. you. We know you. We know you. Well, no, we don't. But uh, we've seen you. We're close to knowing you, and we know you. You, we don't know. Uh, you're shot later, though. Bye. You were the one shot. Uh in the uh, rider attack when you were like kind of on the outside, oh, yeah. you were spiked and then yeah, you got yeah, yeah. Uh, shot after the fact. Accidentally. Um, are you wearing a steward? Get up. Maybe you're the ship steward. That might be the ship steward. You're wearing a steward get up though. So we can mm -hmm. at least mark you as a steward. Let's go ahead and mark him as the ship steward. He is older. Okay. Than the other stewards appear to be. He looks like he's got a little bit more authority too. He's carrying himself with a bit more authority, which is probably yeah. a stretch, but like, yeah. And he's got dark hair, and his pants also suggest kind of, um, perhaps Indian garb. Oh, okay. Like, do all of the? He's got like a little bit more of the, uh, like an apron-y front a little bit. Uh, he does. Do, does everybody? No. No. They all kind of have different things going on. They have, yeah. 
and I find it hard to guess at the what and why of any of that. Agreed. You are a midshipman, probably, but we don't Look know who. Look at his who. sleeveys. Yeah, He's all right, we've got bars. several midshipmen here. Uh, one of whom... Nope, don't know any of them. Yay! All right. Yay! And you are all being pretty good about mostly wearing the same garb, though one of you does have darker pants. Yeah. Actually, no, two of you have darker pants. Well, one of you has lighter pants. And one of them has full pants. The other one has, like, breeches and hose. Are they? The the guy right there. Oh, yeah, yeah, the lighter. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Also, is there somebody behind them? There is. There is. Who are you? You're running this away. Mar you are oh. our... Captain Stewart. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. You're the... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And you're running away. Probably running to get something, I would guess. Just, he seems like he's pretty solid. I don't know. Yeah. I don't think he's just running because he's scared. No, I don't think so. He's, he's going with purpose, though. Who knows what to. Later scenes, honestly, might show us what to. Maybe, um, yeah. Because we're not far off of a whole series of events. Yeah. Ooh, what's Anyone up else up here? here who we can oh, start identifying? Here. Goodness. Yeah. Oh, that's right. We accidentally like got out of the scene a little too fast. Oh, so boy. all of this was a uh, was a uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. This would have made this way easier to I probably identify the surgeon and mm -hmm. uh that's our carpenter. Carpenter. We've not locked in the surgeon's mate yet, have we? We have not. Cuz this looks very surgeon's matey as well. Who? Oh, this, this guy, guy who we have currently marked as carpenter. But he's the one we tried as surgeon's mate. You could be surgeon's mate though. I think that's more likely. Mm. Your hat guy. Your hat guy. Hat well, guy's not a surgeon's mate, is he? Could be. Eh. Probably not, but... I don't think so. Probably not. I'm just going to leave it penciled in, but we're going to change it later, probably. You... We know. Yeah, um, Charles is next to him. Yeah. Um. All right, over here, we've got you... And you, who we've not identified yet. Is that witness? This is the witness, yeah. Okay. And as seamen go, we've got a just all Englishmen now. Okay. And uh, he's definitely a seaman? We're pretty sure. We kind okay. of guessed, uh, just given like where he was and the work he was doing and all that. And the work he's the work he's still doing. He's not either of the Peters brothers, we know that. That's true. So, of the five, we can cut it down to three. Henry, Alexander, and George. Okay, cool. Yeah, that does, that does, that elimination does help. Uh, Lars and, uh, mm. complete unknown. Uh, another of the top men. Yep. What pants do you wear? Broad do you have... Pants. Ooh. You might have the stripe. The stripey, Should, yes. Do you remember which number it was? Uh, okay. <laughs> Mind Palace. I mean, you're not kidding. <laughs> you're not wrong. Um, He's, I thought that person was across the way from the folks from India. Is that correct? Right. What, uh, I don't remember. Neither do I. We may need to hit that scene again. We I'm might sorry. do. It's okay. Um, I think the numbers were counting backward from the center of the boat, yeah? 39, 40, 41? I didn't make any sense of it, but yeah. And I think 39 was closest to I us. I think you're right. I think you're right. So I think that's you. There we yes. go. Okay, yes. <laughs> every every time. It, it feels, feels so good. So good. <laughs> Uh, hey, we got the ship steward right. Yes. By luck. Hey, that wasn't luck. I had reason. <laughs> Dark hair. Lucky, lucky. Hey, and we also got that Mama, right. Maba, yes. Nice. Maba McTorn apart. AKA, not French. <laughs> AKA, only has the one name and I gave him three. If there's two things you are, it's dead and not French. I guess Mick isn't really a name, but he's got the... The, like, Who are you? Short name, and I gave him a big long one. No idea about you. We did get speared by. I'm gonna. Yeah. I'm gonna change this to beasts. Yeah. We uh, we were alerted in the comments that 
foreign enemies do not count if they are not human. So. Uh. I wouldn't call our our crab riders beasts or our mer people beasts. They clearly look like people to me, but. Yeah, like the the riders, if they look like people in seaweed ghillie suits, they kind of do. But like, is my take. They are all beasts, but if there's anything that qualifies as an enemy, that's like the riders are the one thing we've run into. Unless something else shows up in bargain, mm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we're going to encounter anything that counts as an enemy. I don't know. Maybe nickels. Yeah, I guess that's true. You're an enemy, nickels. You're an enemy of mine. Not really. But You're up on like the rigging a little bit. Rigging. We could call you. We could call you a topman. Would you like to be a topman? Do you want to be a topman? You are promoted or demoted, whatever the case may be, to topman. How many? There's a lot left. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not going to be making any guesses on that front. Well, wait, hang on. Some of those were semen down there. I was a little too fast to guess. Yeah, there's actually not very many. Oh, there's... there are three. Let's... One of them is one of the uh, uh, Chinese topmen, and then mm -hmm. two others, Let's... Nicholas and Lewis, and we've... I've got nothing on them. Let's take a look at this gentleman and see if we can figure out a nationality. Hmm. The pants are less likely to be worn by an Englishman, I would think. The Englishmen seem more often to be wearing the short pants with the hose. Like, like, knee pants with hosiery. Yeah. Um, and his top there has more of an Asian look to it. Slightly, perhaps? This one, this one feels very, this, this feels very generic in general. Like, kind of hard to, like, it's hard to... Yeah. Get a lot of details on you. Where else where else are you? Four of the memories. Uh which are you're up here in Soldiers of the Sea. You mm -hmm. die to them afterward, okay. I think. And previously you were here during the fight? Uh with the no, with the uh the cook dying to the yeah. tail whack. Yeah. Don't remember where in that scene you were, but you were there. Uh, and here... He's just got one of those faces. <laughs> uh, Ooh. You're in one of the bunks, I guess. All right. Do you want to bet that he is the other Chinese person who is sleeping? You might be. You might be. Hmm. Can I see the... Um, hmm. Let me, no. Let me see our sketch here. Yeah. Because uh, we've got you identified. So we have, Amazing. was it four Chinese topmen uh, that we had yes. in total? Uh, so you are one of them. Mm -hmm. uh, you are one of them. One. You are one of them. So that's and three. And I thought... You were a topman as well, and I believe you're also acting as translator over here. Mm. So we might be able to just right here, process of elimination, actually yeah. identify you. As Whaley? Maybe. It's worth a shot. Um, I think that makes more sense than the very generic person. I think because so. Because that face, I mean, it is a lot to go on from these drawings, but that face looks less asian than the other face did, yeah, it's so. yeah it's very darned hard to say and he's not wearing the same garb as yeah. a lot of the other uh chinese so topmen have been so let's look at those two englishmen uh the look at the roster for the two english topmen oh, okay um let's see sorry quite all right uh it's nicholas botterill and lewis walker okay I don't know I don't think we got anything on either of these two right now. Yeah. One of yeah. them's knife guy. Oh. Um. Hmm. Yeah. Who do 42 and 44. I have either of those popped into our um, bunk lineup at any point? 44 is asleep in the artist's death. Let's go to the artist's death and let's look at your... Bunk and surrounding... And footwear... I wish I could see Knife Guy here, like, yeah, to get right. for comparison. Knife Guy's got a little hat. Maybe he doesn't wear it while he's sleeping. I don't think he... No, no, Knife Guy's, I think, is bald. I think. Oh, Knife Guy is bald. 
You're right. You're I'm sorry. Of... I was thinking of Hat Dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay. No, Look, no, no. no I'm, just, I'm just, BFFs I'm just enjoying our names. <laughs> they're BFFs, and I think of them as being together. I ship them. Not really, but like they're on a ship, so I had to say it as soon as I thought of it. <laughs> sorry. Um, Quite all right. It's like the mutiny bros. Yeah. They're not really bros, but not like um, Sam and Nathan are. Were. We've got just about everyone else here, I think. Or we've got, like, a few folks left who are just like, we've never seen you. Yeah. We don't know who you are. Okay. But yeah, to wrap up today... No, we've gone too long, but let's let's check the artist's death real fast. And, uh... And see if we can tell who 44 is. Yeah. If 44 sleeps with a blade between his teeth, like Knife Man would. <laughs> I'm so, I feel silly for thinking of, like... No, that one guy was in the death with the was in the scene with the death of the chef, but I don't know where. It's this one. We're in the same one right now. Oh he's he's there. Oh <laughs> I just we'd been in this one so long, and we were on a different text, so I forgot. Me too. <laughs> okay, oh. uh, artist death, artist oh, death, dang. artist death, artist death. Artist. Um, uh, it's it down th one. Or wait, no, it's it, in the kitchen area. I think okay. it's. And then you go out the back. I want to say it's back here no maybe the other, other side end. other side yeah yeah other yeah. end yeah i believe so. yep i believe so other end and then you'll open the doors that are like more straight ahead and yeah through there ha. and there's the artist perfect step. okay and then uh 43 uh can't really see the footwear 44, 44. can't either Right. Okay, but what's around them? Just to be sure. Yeah, is there any information? Not much. Or... There are chests, but not much else. Yeah, okay, so that's not going to be enough to work with, but... Herm. Hmm. Tr tr Shoot. Tr yeah. All right. Boo. It was worth a shot. Oh, this is the correct scene, though, to see our steward walking with... Oh yeah, let's the, do that. His plates of food. We I can think. at least do that. Yep, right you are. And it is you. All right. So let's Third mark mate's you. steward. We got you. We uh caught you. Bam. And nothing, so. <laughs> Yay. Either we've done bad guesses or just got some incomplete information. Whatever. Y'all, thank you so very much for watching. We will see you on Friday when we fill in so many more gaps at the rate we're going. Of course. I feel like we are going to hit a brick wall at some point, and I dread that moment, but it's going to happen. Yep. <laughs> we're get we're doing pretty good here, though. We're we're we've covered a lot. We have, and, and we'll get more next time. Yeah. See you later, everyone. Goodbye. Bye.